Today I'll be showing you how to install the UXP12L connector. The tools required for this install are RD cutter, SP half inch LH4D prep strip tool with U bit, the Gator center conductor cleaner, alcohol cleaning wipe, which is included with every connector, the half inch frame set with either the A insert for DIN connectors or the B insert for N connectors. HCG compression tool, cordless power drill, an adjustable wrench, and either torque wrench for the N or DIN connectors, the TQ114F18 for DIN connectors, and the TW1412 for N connectors. Always wear safety glasses, do not use incorrect tools, and do not blow into prepped cable. Straighten the cable, use the cable cutter to apply even pressure while rotating the tool around the cable to cut off the cable squarely. At this point, if you're using our weather protection system, now is the time to install it. After you install it on the cable, take a clean rag and wipe off the cable. Insert the cable into the prep tool. Activate the drill until the prep tool bottoms out on the cable. Remove the cable from the prep tool. Use the coring bit U to remove dielectric until cable reaches stop on tool. Cable will have approximately one corrugation of dielectric removed. Use the center conductor cleaner, the gator tool, to remove any remaining dielectric material on the center conductor. Using the alcohol pad that was provided with your connector, Clean the center conductor and the outer conductor. Align the top of the outer conductor with the line on the connector cap. Mark the cable at the end of the connector. Insert the connector to the mark. Push pull back the insert to allow the connector to lie flat in the frame. Make sure the connector is fully seated. Press the HCG tool trigger until gun cycles. Do not pull or push on tool or cable during compression. After connector is fully compressed, connector will move away from alignment mark. When using the torque wrench, make sure the mating connector is supported by an adjustable wrench. Now that everything is connected, we want to put our weatherproofing together. We slide them both together like this, and it's as easy as that.